Hello everybody, and welcome to my newest Let's Play. It's Undertale! Alright, so, uh, man, uh, this game it, it got really, really good scores and reviews on Steam, and it's a game that never really stood out to me, but then it was recommended uh, to me by my good friend Drew, and I never played this game before, so I decided, hey, why not share my first experience with this game on camera? So yes, this is going to be a blind playthrough of this game. So, uh, th th I'm, I've never seen, like, anything before. I, like, the only thing I've seen was, like, the demo and, like, a few seconds of a, a Game Grumps video or whatever. But other than that, this video or this playthrough is going to be completely blind. I don't really know what's going to happen. So, yeah, I hope you all enjoy, and I really can't wait to get into this, because I hear it has a lot of funny stuff about it, and... Yeah, I mean, let's let's just jump right into it. Alright, so we've got Z or Enter to confirm, X or Shift to cancel, uh, C or Control to do menu. It actually seems uh, pretty simple, so let's press Z. Alright, name the fallen human. Uh, I mean... Uh... We'll name the fallen human. You know, I can't really think of a pretty good name, so I'm just gonna enter IT for interesting Tim. Yeah, that seems legit to me. All right. Yeah, sure. We'll name uh, it. <laughs> no, but I'm really gonna be pronouncing it IT. All right, here we go. Getting right into it. What's this? Oh, we can move around already? Okay. Hmm. I mean, I guess this is part of the demo, but I really don't remember too much. A flower. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hmm. You're new to the underground, aren't you? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will just have to do. Wow, that reminds me of Gideon from Gravity Falls. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That heart is your soul, the very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. Oh. You idiot. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Oh, jeez. Die. Um... Uh, Yay, we got our health back. <laughs> oh, whoa. What a terrible creature torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Uh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come down here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. Okay. What's this? The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Hey, we can save! Yeah, sure, we'll save. Why not? Wow, this music is beautiful. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. Ooh, got them switch puzzles. The ruins are full of puzzles. Yeah, that's what I said. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Okay. I gotcha. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry. I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Oh, the, this, this Toriel person goat is uh, really, really helping us out. 
Stay on the path. Man, this music! It's so good! I never really gave it a good listen in the demo. Man. Yeah, let's flip the switch. Splendid! I'm proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. As a human living in the other underground, other monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. It will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Okay. You encountered the dummy. Oh my god. This is so funny. So... It, it tells us to, to talk to things? Let's check it. Dummy, it's a uh, cotton heart and a button eye. Okay. You are the <laughs> apple of my eye. Okay. <laughs> um, wow. Already some witty dialogue. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems <laughs> happy with you. Okay, this is actually, this is actually pretty funny. Ah, very good. You are very good. All right, let's follow Toriel again. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you could solve it. Hmm. Well. Um. Let's see. Oh, we got we got a battle going on. Frog it. Oh, I don't want to fight it. I wanna I wanna act. I'm gonna compliment it. Frog it didn't understand what you said, but it was flattered anyways. <laughs> you won. Okay. So I guess Toriel just like stepped in and was like, nope, don't you hurt this child. The western room is uh, the western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Oh hey. Oh, so basically the uh the the lighting here. Okay, I get it now. Alright, so let's go and uh, move on here. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. Uh, so I guess, uh, Toriel wants to do the puzzle for us, or for me. Maybe to, to make sure I don't get hurt. Perhaps. Yeah. I mean, spikes are dangerous. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. Okay. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh. Are we really that bad? <laughs> are we really unreliable like that? Where we, where you have to ask me to walk to the end of the room by myself? Well, I guess we are in a foreign area, so... Well, what's with this music here? Are we just, like, repeating here? It's the same thing over and over again. Oh, no, here we go. Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? Okay. Well, obviously we're not gonna stay here by ourselves, so... Ring. Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous for you to try them- to try to solve them by yourself. Be good, alright? Click. Okay. Uh, so we're gonna save real quick. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. Oh, that's cute. Alright, yeah, we'll save again. And there's a frog in here. Ribbit. Ribbit, excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please, use some mercy, human. Okay. Well, I guess we'll be uh, testing that out right here. A Whimson appeared meekly. Uh, I don't want to fight. I want to act. Uh, we'll check it first. This monster is too sensitive to fight. 
I'm sorry. Oh. Oh, I guess we don't have any, uh, any dodging to do. Yeah, it seems right now that the... That the main gimmick is avoiding the white stuff when your heart appears in that square action area. Halfway through your first word, Wimson bursts into tears and runs away. Okay. Well, that's a thing. Um... Do we go up or do we go down? That's the question. Oh, uh, well, going up, it says take one. Take a piece of candy? Yeah, sure. Um, sure, we'll take more candy. How, disgu <laughs> How disgusting. Yeah, I'll take more candy. You feel like the scum of the air? <laughs> yeah, we'll take more. You took too much too fast. The candy spills onto the floor. Aww. Look at what you've done. Well, ain't that witty. That's quite funny. Alright, let's go. Uh, cracks in the floor? Uh, obviously, uh, I kind of saw that one coming. Guess we'll just appear on the other side here. Ring. Hello, this is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Well, personally, I prefer cinnamon. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Okay. Oh, again? Hello, this is Toriel. You do not dislike butterscotch, do you? I know what your preference is, but... Would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Um, okay. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. Okay, uh... Well, I guess that happened. Froggit hopped close, okay. Um, I never got to check Froggit. Um, life is difficult for this enemy, okay. Let's see if we can help Froggit. Oh, uh, Froggit doesn't want to seem to fight, so I'll, uh, I'll compliment it. Didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyways. Blushes deeply. Oh. Alright. This is a pretty simple attack to avoid. Yeah, you're reluctant to fight you fight me. I'll uh, I'll spare you and win by getting two gold. That's pretty cool. This is a very interesting mechanic. You, you could choose to fight enemies, or you could uh, or you could uh, uh, give them mercy and not fight them. Oh, we fell down a hole. Oh, there's a puzzle. Okay, here. Uh, please don't step on the leaves. Yeah, I'm trying not to. So we get, uh, I assume we gotta remember this pathway for up above. Another frog it. Um, if we just give it mercy, we'll... Meow. What? Meow? Oh, we got hurt. That sucks. You're intimidated by uh, <laughs> frog it's raw strength. Only kidding. Oh my god. This, this game is like... Really just... It's uh, very entertaining. I'll leave it at that. For now. Oh, I totally ran into that fly. Alright, well, yeah, we'll spare. It's reluctant to fight me because I kept complimenting it. Isn't that obvious? Alright, we'll go up. So, uh, we gotta remember. Remember. Uh, do we go up here? Yeah. Oh, wrong way. Okay. Um, yeah, we were supposed to go all the way down and then back up. Uh, do we just give this guy- Yeah, we just give this guy mercy. Okay. He doesn't give us anything, though. So it's a pointless battle. Alright, let's not screw up this time. Alright, good. Good. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so we gotta push the rocks here now. And get into another fight, because- Oh, new enemy! Mold Small and Mold Small blocked the way. Well, let's, uh, check Mold Small and see what they do. Curvaceously attractive, but no grains. <laughs> Sexy wiggle. Slime sounds. Okay. That's attractive. Waits pensively. Okay. Um, do I flirt? You wiggle your hips. Oh, what a meaningful conversation. Okay. Um... So I assume we'll be able to give mercy to uh, to one of these guys. Oh, both of them. Oh, but we got one gold. All right, so let's push these rocks here. Oops. All right, good. Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? 
So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Okay. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Uh... Huh? That was the wrong direction. Okay, think I got it. Um, okay, thank you. <laughs> huh? You wanted me to stay there? You're not giving me a real- you're giving me a real workout. Yeah, well, uh, that was very random. I can definitely see, uh, Earthbound in this game. Oh, man. You tripped into a line of mold smalls. Oh, this is- this could be, uh, this could be a little difficult when it comes to avoiding. But I'll try. I'll try. Um... I assume I'm gonna want to get gold. I, I don't know if the EXP is, uh, worth anything or not, but hey, I'll flirt. You wiggle your hips. I love wiggling my hips. Now, I also assume that I can, like, do the, uh, the whole, uh... The whole flirt thing with all three. And then get gold from all three of them when I give them mercy. Well, something to see. Alright, uh, I'm gonna give mercy now and spare, and we earned- yeah, we earned three gold this that time. That's cool. Alright, what do we got here? Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Oh, hey! Yeah. Alright, so, uh, I'm gonna end the first part here, and save. And, uh, yeah, thank you all very, very much for watching and, and uh, joining me on the first part of Undertale. There'll be many more to come. And I will see you guys next time when we see what is down that hallway over there. Peace out, everybody.